everyone, my name is Jewel Johnson. I'm 19 years old and I'm from the beautiful island of Trinidad and Tobago. I recently graduated from the Institute for American Musical Theatre and now I'm currently employed with the Royal Caribbean Cruise Line. My contract lasts from June the 2nd, 2022 to March the 30th, 2023. Earlier this year, I decided what I really wanted to do was perform on a cruise ship because I'm young and it's a great way to travel, see the world, dance every night, gain experience and get paid for it. It's also an amazing way to save, so I've heard, but I'll have to update you on that throughout my contract. So how did I become a dancer with the Royal Caribbean Cruise Line? At the beginning of this year, Royal Caribbean posted a playbill casting call for dancers for their cruise line. We had to go to Royal Caribbean Cruise Line's website and submit a casting profile. This included our headshot, resume and dance reel. We also had to submit other additional information like our availability date when we could first start a contract. First, I went to royalcaribbeanentertainment.com and clicked the first link that came up. Here you can see their website comes up with a lot of different information and at the top it has sign in and create a profile. At first I had to create a profile but now since I have one I'll show you what it looks like when I'm signed in. Here you can see the media I was required to upload, my headshot, my dance reel and I had to upload a video of me singing. If I click on resume, you can also see that I uploaded my resume in a downloadable format. After creating your profile and applying, you'll get a little message saying your profile has been submitted. The icon to the top right also allows me to view my profile, edit my profile and log out. I put my availability date as the 1st of April. Lo and behold, in the middle of May, I got an email saying, congratulations, you have been offered a contract with Royal Caribbean Cruise Line to be a dancer, showgirl slash vocalist on Spectrum of the Seas. And I was so excited. I know that a lot of other people before COVID might have had to do an in-person audition. However, this was not the case for me. Everything was online. This is why I recommend having an amazing headshot and dance reel because now everything is online and the casting directors are only using your headshot and dance reel for the selection process, at least for the first one or two rounds of submissions. My friend Garrett, they sent him a video with choreography to learn and send back, but also everything was online. Possibly as things get back to normal, they may start more in-person auditions after the first round of submissions online. As an international performer, I was required to get a B1, B2 visa to be able to train in Miami for the two months before I board the ship. Unfortunately, I was denied this visa and it really hurt me to the core, so I thought I wasn't going to be able to do it again. But the managing staff for Royal Caribbean is so great, they created a schedule where I go straight to the ship and learn the entire show from the cast that's already there. So I leave in about one week and then I'll be able to sign on and I'll take you guys through that process as well. When I got offered the contract, I was so excited. The first thing I did was look online on Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, anything I could find to see information about what it's like. And I realized that there were few videos that actually took you through the process. My personal YouTube favorite is Aboard with George. She has amazing videos and on TikTok, it's Summer. I'll insert her name right here. So because I was looking for this information, I decided that when I start my contract, I'm going to document it so that all these new people can see what it's like. Whether you're considering working on a cruise ship, you're a new hire, or you're just curious about what goes on behind the scenes when you're vacationing on a cruise. So please comment below what type of videos you would like to see from me on this journey, whether it's a cabin tour, get ready with me, a day in my life, my morning routine, please let me know and I'll try to do as many videos as possible. While you're down there, don't forget to like and subscribe as it really helps boost my channel and I really appreciate the support. You can also follow me on Instagram and TikTok as I'll also be posting content there as well. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day. See you soon. Bye. Mwah.